Shall we go first? Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, well, the collection was uh, inspired by the royal, you know, modern royal families, uh, what, how they dress up and, you know, I was quite inspired by, uh, I dress up a lot of royal family, uh, you know, members and I got uh, inspired by the, their lifestyle and I made the collection, uh, you know, as I, I, I have been making this, this kind of collection for quite some time now, uh, especially for Wendy's uh, uh, royal families and in Europe as well. Whenever they go out for a, a ball or something, you know, or different sort of appearances, red carpet appearances, they like to wear such kind of gowns here. And also in India, the same culture has uh, uh, you know, come to India. Now all the Bollywood actresses have started wearing such kind of gowns. A lot of clients in India have started wearing such kind of gowns now. And uh, so, but the inspiration came from, you know, how uh, the royals wear uh, ball gowns and all. And, uh, I was also inspired by the, the floral motifs and the butterflies, as if the princess is going to a, you know, an ethereal garden where lots of blooms are there, the butterflies and there are lots of other things. Uh, so it's it's very uh, there are a lot of techniques that have been used, like a lot of couture techniques have been used in making the collection, uh, like scrunching techniques, uh, draping techniques, uh, making uh, you know handcrafted flowers and uh, butterflies, all these things. So it took a lot of time to make this, this collection. It took like uh, from 200 hours to 300 hours to make uh, you know, such elaborate pieces. This collection is uh, very elaborate as you could have seen already on the ramp as well. And uh, yeah, so uh, it has, uh, the color started from white uh, going up to, uh, you know, then there was a uh, darker mood, you know, like as if, uh, you know, there's a darker romance in the collection, uh, in, in the last bit, uh, la la the last sequence, so there are a lo lot of black ones were there. That. So that's about it. Yeah. You want to say something? So our collection is inspired from nature. It's called Maru. Maru means the best state of life in India. So the whole collection is based on the process how the metamorphosis of a caterpillar happens to a butterfly. And the butterfly we've chosen is swallowtail. It's the only butterfly found in North America. In fact, LED was made on Swallowtail. So the collection has a lot of Swarovski. We, as a brand, are associated with Swarovski. So we use Jean-Paul Gaultier, Mazel Margarigella, Kapoorpi. So a lot of different types of Swarovski, which are Swarovski innovations have been used. And a lot of technique has basically been added to the product, like enameling. We, have, in fact, have introduced two new product lines this season, Auto Studio and the Septum Rings. And uh, the collection is a big revelation of something which goes on in my life and that's how the show on up stage from the cocoon to the butterfly. We're not talking about the caterpillar over here because all of us at a certain point of time get stuck and still with a certain sadness or something which doesn't let us go. And that's the time we need to speak to ourselves and do an internal realization of how if we look at a pro uh, positive perspective of things we can evolve into something as beautiful and colorful as a butterfly. So we all need to find our Imago and we've shown that to our whimsical product and collection to a swallow butterfly and we hope you enjoy it. Thank you. Well, as so Amrita said that you know, there's two more than 300 hours of work going on one particular piece and he just told me that this outfit has taken 300 hours so there's a really a lot, lot of time to make an outfit and it does make me look feel like look and make me feel like a princess I actually feel like I've just walked out of a fantasy firm so yeah it's got color it's got, uh, and I also feel somewhere like there's no term called a girly goth but that's what I feel like now <laughs> And everyone can relate to it, you know. Everyone can relate to it now in India, actually, you know. Everyone wants to look like a princess any day, you know. Especially when they, it's they, when it's their wedding, you know, they want to look like they're a princess, you know. So I've, I've made the dance, you know, keeping in mind Indian girls who want to look like princess. And they do make them look like princess. <laughs> I would wear it to a reception. I would wear it to one of the red carpets. I would. Uh, it is very, of course, yes, that one is a uh, red carpet, so uh, it is very conventional. I can wear it to a wedding, I can wear it to my 
uh, official event, so it's it's not it doesn't like what do you really say that okay this is something you only have to wait for already. This is something you only have to wait for already. This is not tagged that way. You can wear it wherever you want to wear it, and it does make it makes you feel pretty. It makes you feel princessy. It makes you feel ladylike. कारीगर तो यहाँ पे ही हैं लेकिन उनको ट्रेनिंग का स्पेशल दी गई है एक्चुअली मैंने जब इटली में स्टडी करी थी वो कुठियो टेक्निक वगैरह और क्राफ्टमैनशिप जो कुठियो और वो लोग जो पेरिस और मिलान में करते हैं तो वो ही मैंने इंडिया में उनको मैंने ट्रेनिंग दी है आज से उनको यहाँ पे कि कैसे वैसी टेक्निक्स यूज़ करी है और इंडियन टेक्निक्स तो स्पेशल है ही वैसे भी तो दोनों को फ्यूजन भी यूज़ हुआ है इस कलेक्शन में तो वो एक स्पेशल बनाता है कलेक्शन ज़रा हाँ राजस्थान के हैं बहुत से बनारस के हैं और कुछ बंगाल के हैं और इनको अलग से स्पेशल ट्रेनिंग दी गई है पहले एक्चुअली कलेक्शन जब मैंने अपना स्टार्ट किया था अपना करियर तो मैंने डॉल्चे गबाना और वो नीना रिची और इन सब जो बड़े फैशन हाउसेज हैं उनके साथ काम करके स्टार्ट किया था तो आई लर्न टू लॉर्ड ऑफ यू नो इंटरनेशनल टेक्निक्स दैर आई यूज टू कुछ when I, uh, I mean, that I use for, in, for Indian market also, yeah. Like, so, you know, we have an installation outside for five days. In fact, there's an exhibit which we have done. When you enter, there's an exhibit, so the entire story has been written and quoted over there. Like I said, like, the whole collection is on a swallowtail butterfly. If you see the exhibit closely, the whole craftsmanship, like, it's taken hours and hours of work to put the concept and the craftsmanship together. And it'll resonate in the installation also. But here, you know, in a way, this is the second ring which we have been reduced. It's an editorial brief. And again, a lot of marjala has been used, a lot of trophy has been used. Again, you can see it's all from the wings of the solar tail. So one particular uh, motive has been taken and basically you can elaborate on that aspect. 